It's a Kinsey 2000 six row corn with five pushers, so I run 11 rows on beans, 15 inch. Well, on the front, of course, are the bean units. Uh, I've got a no-till cutter on there, uh, and it's pretty basic setup. I've got seed firmers just to help push it down. And for closing, I've got one spike wheel, one rubber wheel. It just kind of covers all angles if it's dry or whatever. And then for the corn, I've got a single disc fertilizer opener set on two by two for my starter fertilizer, which we put 15 to 20 gallon of 28 with some thiazole and zinc in. And then I've got row cleaners and no-till cutters, which really aren't necessary. They're on there. I use them for the beans because when I plant beans, I raise the row cleaners up out of the way. I don't really want them on there. Uh, and then I've got the planting unit set up. It's just a regular double disc openers, Keaton seed firmers, the reduced inner diameter uh, gauge wheels. Uh, and then I've got spike closing wheels on the back. Uh, I have found what really, especially behind this strip tiller, and they really work well in all different ways, are the Great Plains spike closing wheels. They've got little hooks on them. I really like those, and then there's a drag chain behind it just to make sure everything is sealed up good. I do run the precision seed tubes and finger units. I just, the accuracy on them has really amazed me. I went to those about three years ago and I could see the difference just walking in the field. Mm -hmm.